Here's probably the worst um, animal cr cruelty case I had to read. Here we go. Man hacked Pitbull to pieces, deputies say. Uh, when the animal control officer arrived, deputies, quote, wouldn't even let him in the house. They said it looked like a murder scene. Uh, Bugsy, a male Pitbull, had been hacked to pieces, according to the incident report. Sean Vincent Thayer, a 51-year-old Destin man, accused of hacking his friend's dog to death with a meat cleaver and then telling her to look at the blood and remember, was arrested Monday and charged with causing cruel death, pain, and suffering to an animal. We've seen a lot of animal cruelty cases, this, cases but nothing that ever came close to the sheer horrific brul brutality of, to this dog. Investigators initially thought the dog, which had bitten its owner, was killed in self-defense. But upon further investigation, we reopened the case. Uh, the report from the March 4th early morning attack states Bugsy had so many wounds that they could not be counted. However, Thompson estimated the 75 to 80 pound dog was struck with a cleaver at least 70, 70, 70 times. In the initial incident report, Thayer told deputies that he had a friend. Marie Haggerty, and they were intoxicated and drinking in her living room when Bugsy started acting up. Well, I'm wondering because they started acting up. Haggerty yelled at Bugsy to settle him down and said the dog bit her on the arm, then turned on him, biting him on the hands and wrist. Well, pfft. later, duh, he, uh, they were jumping around and everything. Thayer said he was able to retrieve a meat cleaver from the kitchen and began swinging it at Bugsy and that the attack continued throughout the residence. Later, he took the dog's body outside and placed it on the driveway, covering it with a sheet. This is the initial report. It was determined that Thayer killed Bugsy in self-defense and the case was closed. But it was reopened the following day when Thompson contacted the sheriff's office to relay the, the results of the necropsy as well as additional information that she had received. The result the test showed that the dog has suffered severe blood loss and definitely bled out. Second interview, Haggerty Haggerty said Bugsy initially appeared happy to see Thera when he first arrived at the house. What happened is he would come in her house and would start screaming, ranting and raving. The, the dog would start barking, she was trying to get him to stop. That's when Thayer grabbed a meat cleaver and began chasing Bugsy around the house. The area around the dog bed and the living room was drenched in blood, and the blood was smeared on the lower part of the wall, indicating the dog had retreated as far as he was able, smearing his bleeding body all over part of the sheetrock. It's disgusting. <laughs>